challenge on Facebook. So go find that, watch it and learn because there was some great information on there. And I'll tell you one thing, one of the many things that I got out of it, but they got me super excited. If y'all haven't checked out your AOR credits or points or whatever yet, go do it. I am so excited. So I, I got on that Zoom, right? And I, I heard, you know, Chris was talking about how he booked his room for the Fort Worth event that we're going to talk about in a minute, but he booked his room there for free and he got a suite. And I'm like, wait a minute, how does this work, right? How in the world does that work? So I tried it. So I downloaded the AOR app to my phone. So it's gold. Just search for, you know, RX AOR. I don't know what it looks like on the front, but it's going to kind of look something like that. I don't know if you can see that, uh, but go download that, throw it on your phone. It's going to tell you how many credits you have available. And then you just click get it and you can download it in increments of 10,000, I think, and just load it onto your e-wallet. And then you go back into that RX travel and it shows up as money. So literally I just did it for my room in Fort Worth. The room was like 325 because I didn't get the fancy one <laughs> like Chris did. 325, I'm paying nothing, nothing. Like so excited about that. And you can also use it for your product and you can use it for jewelry. So I'm thinking I need to get a little something to match my necklace. So that'll be the next item on the list that I use it for. So hopefully you guys can check that out. And then wanted to talk to you super quick about the Fort Worth event. So it's happening. Um, uh, some of the leaders are putting that on. Let me see if I can, I've got a little flyer, I think. Let's see if I can show y'all. Um, so it's taking place September 18th and 19th. It's in your back office. You guys can you know, sign up for that now. Go ahead and purchase your ticket, but it's going to be a phenomenal event. And Todd maybe can share a little bit of details with us um, this evening if he doesn't mind, but just super excited for that. It's gonna be phenomenal. But right now what I'm gonna do is I have a very special guest on here that I would like to introduce. So he's got a phenomenal story, right? I'm gonna show you a couple pictures here really quickly. Um, if you guys don't know Richard, Richard Tuggle yet, you will, because he's all over Facebook and all of that. Phenomenal transformation. We can all learn from what he has created in his business. But I'm going to tell you just personally, what I love the most about him is his willingness to help. And I have, you know, I had not met him yet. And I was in Arkansas to help out with an event out there with Joe Mitchell and her group. And he came. And not only did he come to support the event, but he helped answer questions. He had no relationship to anybody in the room. He had no reason to help me out, but I'll tell you, he did, and it was great. And so I've had the opportunity to spend a little bit of time with him since then, and just great, great gentleman and a phenomenal transformation. So Richard, you should be able to unmute yourself. And I was hoping you wouldn't mind just sharing with us your transformation. Sure, can you hear me? Andrew. I can. There you are. I see you okay. now. Thank yeah. you so much for being on here tonight. Well, it's my pleasure. My pleasure. Hey, um, yeah, my transformation, you know, um, I started in October of 2018 and I really wasn't going to do the business, but I was having some some pretty bad health uh, problems and a nurse friend of mine got me on the products, a Transform Pack C. I thought all this company had was a Transform Pack C when I joined. I didn't know they had anything else. I knew they had Crystal and Todd Rowland, but mm -hmm. I didn't know they had anything else, but I, I got it. And you know, the first 85 pounds was pretty easy to lose. Uh, I've lost 15 since then, and that's been the hard part. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I lost 60 pounds my first two days um, on the MOA, on the drops, and the Rejuvenex tablets. And then I, course I had to reorder and I lost another 25 pounds that next 60 days Andrew without any exercise at all wow. uh, I said man when they told me you don't need to really exercise if you've been walking for your heart go ahead and keep walking or something but I said man this is this is the kind of a program I won't own you know and, and of course I jumped all over it and then his you know they invited me to come to Salt Lake City to meet some of the owners and I did that and been on board since February last year pretty much um, uh, I'm like Chris Dole I'm part-time but which 12 hours do I work the 
you know, the first 12 of the day or the second 12. Um, but anyhow, still got a lot of real estate stuff going on. Um, but it, it's been great. Um, now, I will tell you, it's not easy. It's the easiest thing I ever saw trying to lose weight. I tried to lose weight a lot of times before, but, but it, it does take dedication. And uh, I have found out after hundreds of people has joined our team that um, if you let them know up front that it will take some willpower, but you're willing to stick right in there with them, you know, you're calling them every two or three days because that's what Chris Dole did with me. Mm. He called me every two or three days because he knew if I had a transformation, people would be asking about it and I'd get them signed up. I'd be making some money and then, and then they, he knew that he could, Move me over to the business side. And that's what happened. Well, I love it. I love your transformation. It's phenomenal. And you are heading up an event this next weekend. So I wanted to share this flyer real quick with everybody. But would you mind telling us just a little bit about that? Why do we need to be there? Why do we want to be there? And kind of what we, we can expect a little bit? I sure will. Of course, Dr. Ginger is pro probably the most uh, sought out speaker out there. And, um, you know, when she agreed to come to Arkansas, of course, it, it didn't hurt anything that Chris Dole is, is her and Aaron, her husband's uh, sponsor. And then, of course, Todd is Chris sponsor. So that didn't hurt anything either, getting her to Arkansas. Um, but it's on the 7th, 8th, and 9th. And um, we, we're going to start on that Friday. Uh, around 5.30. You can check into the lodge. You can come to the lodge uh, as early as three o'clock, uh, but we're probably gonna try to kick it off around 5.30. We'll have some testimonies there um, that night, and then we're gonna have a, a business presentation. So if you've got any guests, you need to bring them uh, to that. I guarantee they'll sign up. And then, and then Ginger's gonna do her part uh, that night also. And of course, we're gonna be Probably after the meeting, the meeting will start. You know how that goes. We'll be in some breakout sessions. There's plenty of pavilions. There's a pool out there with a fire pit. There's three or four living rooms in the two lodges there. There's plenty of places to gather. Now, Saturday morning, we're going to start at 9 a.m. Uh, if you want to get there a little early, we're, the company has sent plenty of pure nurse chocolate, mm -hmm. Um, and vanilla and orange uh, for us to eat for breakfast. So if you want to come in early, we're going to be serving that for breakfast. And then 9 a.m., we're going to be doing something for guests again. And um, then we'll have speakers lined up. Of course, Todd Rowland, Chris Dole, um, Aaron Decker. Aaron's going to MC it. Uh, he is great, awesome. If y'all been watching him, uh, Aaron is on fire, Aaron Decker. And of course, Dr. Ginger is going to be training that. And then at one o'clock, we're going to break at noon for sandwiches and stuff right there on the premises. And then at one o'clock, we're coming back and we're going to hear from you and Brent Palmer and Myra Miles and whoever else Brent has come up. Um, and um, we're going to hear from that for about an hour, hour and a half. And then some more training from Dr. Ginger and some more testimonies. Um, it'll go on and, and like I said after the meeting after the training we'll have some breakout sessions there too now uh, we do have one room left in the main lodge um, it has become available and then we still have um, some room, some beds in the, in the men's bunk room and the women's bunk room that hasn't been filled yet of course just 12 miles down the road is Bates for Arkansas and there's a lot of motels there now, Sunday, we're going to be eating breakfast again, Pure Nourish, my favorite breakfast. I mean, mm -hmm. I have it every morning. And, um, but everybody's invited to go to John 316 Ministries if they want to. Uh, it starts like at 940 Sunday morning, doesn't end until noon on Sunday. But also, they ask us to have everything out of the lodge by noon on Sunday. Awesome. Well, it sounds like it's going to be a phenomenal event. I know we just got out of Utah. It feels like we just got out of Utah. That was such a incredible event. And then to be able to move, take that excitement into here, I think it's going to be phenomenal. So anybody 
that's local join us because I think it's going to be a really, really great, powerful, powerful event. Well, well Andrea, when, anytime you've got Dr. Ginger and you've got Aaron and you've got Todd and Chris and Brent and then, and then some of the other speakers all at one event, what could you ask for? I mean, that's, I mean, that that's it right there right right well thank you so much i love your story i love your transformation i love your heart thank you for all the help that you've given me over the last few months and excited to continue to build with you guys through the course of our future here with rx so thank you so much richard appreciate you, you being on here so guys we're going to kind of change gears a little bit and now we're going to bring on coach roland so todd roland that I actually had the privilege of seeing him speak um, a million years ago, it feels like. It was actually when he was in his first company and um, I got to be in the audience. And when I heard his name here, I'm like, oh my gosh, I know Todd Rowland, like, wow, right? So to be able to be in his presence and just a little bit of history about him, he has about 20 years, and Todd, if I screw any of this up, I apologize, um, but it, it's done with love. But he has about 20 years experience in this industry. I mean, what a wealth of knowledge just with that amount of experience. He's earned millions of dollars, right? Which I think is all of our goals is to go change our life, create something that's gonna create a legacy, and he's absolutely done that. But one of the things that you'll see about him is that week over week, when you look at those power rankers, you're gonna see his name, which means he's still out there, even though he probably could walk away, right? He's still out there creating more business, building a business and helping his team. So Todd, thank you so much for being on here. And you should be able to unmute yourself. Yes, I think I'm with you, Andrea. <laughs> You're here, thank you so much, Todd, appreciate it. Thank you so much for being on here with me this evening. Yes, you're, a, you're an amazing conduit of information. You, so glad we're getting to work together finally. And Richard Tuggle, who you just had, is he's just an amazing human being. And I lo we did one other event at his John 316 Ministries. And it's, the best thing about it is when you get there, there's nowhere to go. You're stuck in the absolute middle of nowhere. You're in the middle of a deer farm. And um, so it's just a great time to be stuck with each other, eating nuts and pure nourish and berries. He's, he only serves the approved food list. So if you're not on it, get prepared to, to move over when you get there. But Richard does an amazing job. Well, I can't wait. I'm super excited. So what I was hoping you wouldn't mind, just kind of kicking us off with your story tonight of just how you found this industry, what it has done for your family. Hey, y'all. Welcome to the Hi, Aunt. Todd, are you there? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. So, Andrea, it's, you know, it's when you say 20 years, it's, it, you know, everything in life is a blink. But um, it seems mm -hmm. like yesterday that I was coaching high school football in the state of Arkansas. I had previously coached in Tennessee. It was my profession. I loved it. I had gone back and got my master's degree in kinesiology. I thought I might move in to coaching in college. I had actually coached with and against Hugh Freeze. Uh, when I was in Tennessee, and then Gus Malzahn was in my district when who's at Auburn now. Gus is at was at Ole Miss is now at Liberty. So I kind of thought my track would be right along with those guys. I just thought we I'd just keep moving up the ranks. But during that time frame, my wife and I kept having kids, and we had child two, three, and four really close together. Two and three came eleven months apart. Wow! And if you um, know much about a high school coach's salary it doesn't move fast enough to keep up with the pricing of insurance and diapers and baby food and expanded needs of places to sleep. Just all the things that come along with an expanding family. And, you know, I, I didn't really know what to do. So I, I did, I'm, I'm a, a faith filled person. So I prayed a lot looking for something better. And I, I didn't pray for network marketing and surely didn't, I really didn't even know what it was. I had, one brief exposure to a company called Advocare in the 90s, but I didn't do the business. I just, that was the only thing I even knew about it. But um, a company came along in 2001 and I got involved and for extra income like we all do. And over the course of a few years part-time, it was tripling my coach's income and I went full-time. And that's where I met you the first time, Andrea, out in Temecula, California, in somewhere in the mid to late mid 2000s, I think. But our business grew all throughout the country and our income, I mean, it really grew. We ended up with a 
airplane, a pilot. It was a, it was a really neat experience. But um, like so many companies in our industry, it wasn't designed to go long term. And uh, the way I explain it to people is the first time the, this industry found me. But when I realized that company, after being with it for 12 years, wasn't going to be around 30 years from now, mm-hmm. myself, along with others that had done well, we went and studied owners and compensation plans and product quality. And we were evaluating with the end in mind. And when we came across the owners from RX and we heard their vision and we heard them talking about creating one day a 10, 12, $15 billion company. We met Deanna and found that she had zero compromise on product quality. She always sourced from the best ingredients. When we started dissecting the compensation plan and we found out that matching check didn't have breakaways and there was a, a stability there. And we found out if you built the residual income that you didn't have to worry about making something happen to get paid. You could actually walk away and go out of the country for 10 years. And as long as you have your $150 auto ship, you're going to get paid every Friday. And it just kept being check, 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 check. And when we got made the decision to come to RX seven years ago, there was a group of about 12 of us. Hmm. There really wasn't, when we got to the end, a second choice. It was so much better than everything else, but still we were all very nervous. Um, simply because at that particular time we had been burned pretty good. We'd all built large businesses and we were seeing them disappear and, and uh, we never wanted that to happen again to ourselves or anybody else. So we, uh, you know, when we got in the company, um, they had to still prove themselves, but seven years in, it's better than we expected. Uh, the future is so bright. They've gotten more capital by going public. So the expansion into other countries, the, the division, uh, the product expansion is going to be more rapid now. Uh, if you happen to come across somebody that owns a company that wanted to merge in, their ability to get those people merged into your organization has become more fluid. So, you know, I just see over the next 10 years that this company be- could become the greatest network marketing company ever. It's going to be run as a real business. And it's a chance, Andrea, really for all of us to go do something special and put a mark on our family forever. Let our kids fight over it. See your kids traveling. I know y'all went on a summer vacation and, you know, let them fight over your income. You're going to leave them 50 years from now. They just, they, <laughs> maybe your grandkids will be fighting over it. Well, or how about we make enough that they don't even need to fight, right? There's just even better enough <laughs> that it'll just spread around. I think that sounds, that sounds ideal. Well, I love that. And that's a, a phenomenal story. And I know we, it feels like just yesterday we got home from Utah. I don't even know how long it's been. Um, but you put on just an incredible event. So thank you so much for that event. And one like recurring theme that I felt was just so much that I was absolutely in the right place. And what a great feeling to be in the right place at the right time. So with that, my question for you as a person that has Bill, sorry, there's chaos here. Just it, it, it's chaos. 47 pets and a thousand kids is what it sounds like over here. But as a person that's built, I, you know, in through a variety of different circumstances, what would you say that you would recommend for all of us to do right now to just capitalize on this momentum, capitalize on what Rx is doing and with everything that's going on today? Yeah, you know, the event in in Park City and in Salt Lake, the events are always made by the people. So what makes it feel so right is just the quality of people that are being attracted to our company. You know, the Lemu group that moved over, your culture is just so amazing. It really fits the culture that was already here. We've just got a lot of quality people that genuinely care about others. And, and um, you know, we live in the, the law of abundance that there's plenty for all. We just got to go build it. It just takes some time. You know you know, Andrew, to answer that question, I think a lot of times people hear a story and when they hear the story, it automatically moves them into, oh, that's, he's that guy. Um, but it's the furthest thing from the truth. We all have rock bottoms in our life. Um, when I got involved in network marketing, I was really at rock bottom. I, um, I love coaching. I'd won the state championship, which was the pinnacle of what you really coach for. But um, I was so um, behind financially. I was very empty. I, I just I, I didn't want to live so broke. And I spent a, a decade and, and built our way out of that. And I saw a company disappear. And 
And, mm -hmm. um, and uh, I was devastated really again. It was a different level of devastation. It was, I wasn't back to paycheck to paycheck, but I saw a lot of nice things disappear and I had to restart again. But I always think that God sometimes puts us at rock bottom to prepare us for a steeper climb mm -hmm. and really to get us into greatness because we learn the most when things are not going good. When we're kind of in the pit is where maybe our sensories get more active. We get more in tune to our faith. We get more in tune to maybe growing ourselves. We, um, that's where we kind of, that's our starting point. So, you know, never think of somebody that's having success as different than you. Just think of it as somebody that when they were in their pit, they didn't give up hope. I, I think that um, prayers are always answered. They, they sometimes are answered differently than what exactly what we pray but prayers are, what I always tell people is it requires faith for your prayer to become answered so when we came to rx I wasn't ready to work um it took me a while to build my belief in the industry because of what had happened but I had total faith in rx and the owner so I knew I for me I knew that God had put me in this company and I was just waiting for the ability to really go work and make a difference in people's lives and it him to allow me to go really do that took longer than I expected. I've only really been working RX full time for just a couple of years. I took five years off when my kids were in high school and, and had to kind of reset in life. So anyway, I hope I'm talking to somebody out there that when you, when you um, get ready to, to, to move forward again in life, just know that this climb is going to take you to a higher level. You, if you're listening to this tonight and you're in RX, you know, you couldn't, you could not dream up a better opportunity. Um, you're just sitting in the right spot at the right time. We're direct to the consumer. We have quality products in a world that's becoming more educated on nutrition, that wants a boosted immune system. Uh, you know, the, for, for the first time in 20 years in network marketing, having a home-based business is not taboo anymore. Yes. People are very attracted to what we do. It's becoming like we're the smart ones and they're the dumb ones now. So it's like everything is on your side, and it, which will allow you to advance very, very rapidly, much, much quicker than under normal circumstances. And then, you know, I'm not a, I'm not a stock market guru at all. Um, um, as a matter of fact, I'm a football coach and barely got out of high school uh, grade-wise. I always joke all the people that when I send out Facebook text or Twitter text or text blast messages, I can never do it without misspelling a word. And there's always an English teacher on the other side <laughs> correcting me. I try my best, but it's, uh, but, uh, but anyway, I say that cause I don't want anybody to think I'm giving them stock advice, but I just believe that with the stock price as low as it is today, a little over $2 with our company, that there's not much downside risk and, knowing what these guys have done in a previous company, taking a stock to $80 that split four times along, the, which split twice, which, which multiplies it times four along the way. Mm -hmm. um, so it's 270 times up from the day it went public with them the first time. So, you know, they've got a track record. I believe in them. They have integrity. They're very conservative. They know what their profit margin is going to be. So Jeff said on his call Saturday before last, don't expect much for at least two quarters that what the, all the big investing institutions want to see are two quarters of consecutive growth and profitability. So it may take them six months to get the stock headed north, but I see that as opportunity. I see that as a time for us to buy because I don't want to buy it when it, you know, I don't want to put my money in when it's already $35. I want to be buying it when it's less than three. So when it's at 35, my money's already 10 times. So just a great chance every Friday when you get paid by RX to stick a little money on the side. I've used that Robin hood app and it's, um, for the first time in my life, I'm actually doing it myself. It's, it's actually pretty easy on that app. It's actually, as my wife tells me now, it's too easy. She must be being careful on there because she, uh, she knows I'm not a professional. But anyway, so that's not stock advice. But I think we have two routes now, building our business and then maybe taking some funds from what we make every Friday and sticking them on the side and letting them start multiplying on the side and, you know, having a, a real nice nest egg for us all here in four, five, six years. Oh, yes. Well, I'm excited about that part, too. I love being able to have, it just feels a little different. It's kind of crazy, but it feels like I've always had ownership of my business, right? And what I'm creating for my family, but to feel like you have ownership on a bigger level is very empowering. It's very exciting. So I'm doing the same thing every Friday, 
just tucking a little bit more in there. So I'm kind of grateful for the six month period to build that up as much as I can. But um, so you you brought, I'm scribbling notes while you're talking. I'm gonna have to watch this recording so I can get more out of that. So I've got one last question and then I'll let you be, but thank you again for being on here. But just the, the last question is one thing is we just, you know, we see your name every week on that power ranker. Rankers, power, you know what they're called. Um, what's the, what would, should we be doing to try to get our names on there? What are you doing to keep yourself on there? That. Okay, so the power rankings are really a unique feature in our company because they do not reward necessarily just big paychecks. So there's five different things the power ranking tracks. Your, your weekly income is, is, so it's one, it's one fifth of the equation. Okay. Personal sponsoring is actually another fifth. So if you have a big paycheck, but you aren't personally sponsoring, you're going to fall out of the top 25. New growth going forward, meaning that your business is growing. For example, if you made 2000 in base pay um, six months ago and your base pay today is 2000, then in the, 20% that tracks growth, you would get a zero uh, because it's not growing. If it's up to like three or 4,000, then you're gonna, it's going to be measuring you against other people growing. Uh, then it's going to measure retention on auto ship. So like, like one of the things we do that I think that you guys do extremely well, because one thing I noticed about all the Moo reps is one, they're all positive. And, and but the second thing is they all completely believe in Lemu products. So that tells me you guys have a great education system and a great product line. And it's the same thing. What we've always done with, we use Dr. Ginger, we use Deanna, we get her on the Zooms. We learn and try to train the best we can, but we really educate on products. And so that keeps, when, when products are making a difference in people's lives and people are educated on them, you know, the retention is going to be much greater than if somebody just gets signed up and nobody ever follows up with them again. And they didn't really ever know how to take it in the first place and really didn't even know what it was supposed to do. Um, so retention is one of them. And then matching check, like your matching check being your organizational growth. So base pay is your growth. Organizational growth, meaning you could have a leader taken off in your organization that would help track it too. Um, so those are the five different ways. So, you know, I can name people right now that are at a quarter million dollars a year in the United States that don't show up in the top 25 power rankers. And I've got people that I know in my business that have been in the top 10 that really are just getting started good, just making, you know, a couple thousand dollars of combined income, most of it being team lead bonus uh, in the beginning. So you can really pop in there very quickly. And then um, I think it's easier to pop in than it is to get started. And then the other thing, this is really great for new people because you were talking about those travel dollars or, or um, AOR dollars is, is you get, you earn those 10 different ways, personally sponsoring, Actually, if you go watch the boss videos, business orientation system in your ex office, you get paid 20 real dollars for just watching those videos. But yeah. the number one way to earn those extra free dollars is to increase your base pay 26 week period over 26 week period. And we just started our next 26 week period on July 1st. So that'll run to December 31st. So for brand new people, you're competing against zero. So for every, every $750 in base pay you make, you get $250 real dollars put into that e-wallet or travel when that occurs. So it's, um, it's a great way uh, to, you know, expand that. I mean, if somebody went out there and made $7,500, that'd be 10 250s or $2,500 in there. And then, you know, if somebody were to hit something great, really take off. I, I mean, I've seen people pop $25,000 in a 26-week period into their travel account. So it can, you know, take your family – to Europe for a month and, yes. and come back with money left. I love it. Wow, that's incredible. Well, that's that's a goal. So I love that so much. And thank you so much, Todd, for being on here tonight, sharing all your wisdom. I'm going to be watching you again because I want to be able to take more notes. But I definitely appreciate your time. And Richard, I appreciate your time as well. And everybody, thanks for tuning in with us on Sunday. And we'll be back. We've got um, prospecting Zooms throughout the week. Hopefully you all have seen the schedule. We updated it a little bit to include the corporate information. So we have those. So just look for that. It's a pin post in RX Nation. And I'm confident a little, I hope it's over in Moa 
I think I put it in MOA challenge as well. I don't remember, um, but hopefully it's over there as well. Um, but we'll see you guys back here on Wednesday on this same channel and um, can't wait for this week. So thank you guys. And I'll see you guys out in Arkansas just this weekend. Thanks guys. Have a good night.